Hey guys, welcome to Repurpose My Way. I'm Shelly and we're gonna do some chicken stuff today. So I bought this uh, cutting board at the Goodwill, I believe, a couple bucks. I don't really remember, the sticker's gone now. But I love the shape and I wanna use it as a template. So I'm gonna do a little something different though. It's not gonna look like this. I wanna do a little something different with it, but I do wanna use the shape to build on. So what I'm gonna do, scrap wood again. I've got all kinds of these, so you're gonna see a lot of this stuff. So what I wanna do is I wanna trace the outline of this chicken or rooster, could be either, um, and put it on here and trace it out. Um, when it gets down to the feet, what I wanna do is make a skinnier part um, of board that's gonna go down, so I'm not gonna use the feet. It's gonna be like from here down, it's gonna be a straight board. Because what I wanna do after that is make a, um, I don't know if I wanna use drop cloth or I wanna use something to go over it and make like a pocket around it around the bottom. So this is sticking up and then in that pocket you can put flowers, you can put spoons, you can put towels, whatever, what have you, whatever you'd like. Um, and so it's gonna be like a wall decor using this chicken rooster. So let's get to it. Before I go any further, I've got some big news. This is going to be a giveaway. It's not finished yet, but when I reach 300 subscribers, I'm at 220, 221, something like that right now. When I reach 300 subscribers, I'm gonna give this away. And at the end of this video, I'll let you know what to do in order to qualify to win this. And I'll do a random pick uh, from those qualifications and somebody will get this for their kitchen. Of course, it's not finished yet, so stick around and we'll get to finishing it. All right, so what we're gonna do is use our hot glue gun and I'm gonna fold over a little bit of this material that I have to make a nice clean edge. On there. 
I think that's about wide enough. Yeah. Okay, so basically what I'm do is make it, doing is making a pocket on the front. So I'm gonna make it kind of tight, but not too tight. I'm just gonna glue the bottom. And you're not gonna be able to see that, so I'm not gonna worry about Folding that edge, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Let's see, I'm gonna make like a little nice edge here, I hope. Let me get rid of some excess. Material. Oops, that's not what I want to do. Let's do that first. What am I thinking? There we go. Let's check that. No, oh, that's a little. That's a little puckered. Pull that off. Fix that. Tight enough. There we go. That's better. And I don't want it too, too tight. The pocket to be too tight so I'm not going to pull it super tight but I want to get the wrinkles out okay let's, let's do this side slack out of here. All right, so we got the pocket on there and I stripped a couple uh, pieces off and glued them together because they didn't have any long enough. I want to do a little something around the neck, the same color, kind of bring the two pieces together and turn this around so that I make a nice Nice little bow on this guy. Maybe. All right. And then let's trim. I These scissors are terrible. I got to bring down a pair of my others. Okay. So. There we go. So there's a nice bow for him. I got these red pit berries and I'm just gonna I just bundled them up together just tied the what just wrap not really tied but I wrapped the wire around and we're gonna stick those right in there like so and kind of spread them out a little bit make them look full make them look pretty so then I have this twine and I'm gonna take this twine, flip this over. I've got these on some boards so they're not gonna crush the berries. But I wanted the berries in there before I start this part, which is I'm going to wrap this twine around. I'm 
this um, little pocket. And we're just gonna go around a bunch of times. Go every which way, kind of crisscross them. Okay. Put another little dab of glue over here. Hopefully, there we go. Okay. There's that. There we go. And then I've got a rusty star. I'm trying to decide if I want it there or there. I think down here on the raffia. Uh, on the twine, not the raffia. Put it right on there. Little kitty cornered. And then I wonder. I want to do a couple pieces around here too, just to tie the two together. Yeah. So flip it over. I think I'm gonna tie it. There we go. And then we'll just go under and kind of zigzag it around. And then I'll tie that one to this one. I could do a little bow tie on the front or whatever, like I did with the material, but I think I'm just gonna do this. There we go. And then. All right, so I decided because I need a little bit of something in this pocket, I'm gonna take these out and I've got some moss and I'm gonna stick some moss in on the sides. Just a little, so it's sticking out a little bit. So it's sticking out of there a little like that. Hopefully you guys can see. And then I'm gonna stick this back in and hope that that sticks out enough so you can see what I'm talking about. There, I like that a little better with the moss in there. It kind of adds something to it. So it looks better to me. Hopefully it looks better to you. So guys, in order to win this and have this mailed to you, I've got to reach 300 subscribers. I'm at 220 right now. Eventually I'll get up to 300, hopefully soon. In order to do that, maybe you guys could uh, like, share, and if you're not subscribed, consider subscribing. So share this video out to your friends um, and, and maybe somebody would be interested in seeing how I did this in some of my other videos. And then that will get me more subscribers, hopefully if they like it. And then uh, once I reach 300, somebody's gonna win this. So to qualify to win this and for me to mail this to you, what you need to do is be subscribed to my channel, like, share, and leave a comment down below this video and um, good luck, that's it. That's all you gotta do to win this. And I will do a drawing live once I reach the 300 subscribers and it sticks. Uh, Cause we all know if you're a creator, the numbers go up and down all the time. So you never know. But once I get to 300 and it sticks and stays, uh, this guy is going to get raffled off. Random raffle from this video, I will pick a winner. So if you're interested in winning this, Follow the directions and we will talk to you later. Thanks for watching guys. Have a good one.